It's a little spicy. Welcome to whiskey.com, where fine spirits meet. My name is Lüning, Horst Lüning. I'm the master taster of whiskey.com. And today we taste the snow grouse. What's that? Well, that's a line extension to the famous grouse. So, yes, the famous grouse I still have to taste. I apologize for that. Uh, so the snow grouse comes first. And uh, roughly 10 years ago, there had been a first snow grouse out on the market and it has an, an etched surface. If you put a glass bottle into acid, uh, then it turns in a satin style. It looked very famous and excellent. Uh, and today, well, this is gone and there's only uh, some, well, some ice crystal design on the bottle. It's uh, cheap glass and yeah and two labels front and back um, and I bought this in a travel value shop I was lately in Norway and on the ferry I bought this um, and it says the snow grouse uh, I said it's a line extension to the famous grouse and famous grouse is well the biggest brand of blended whiskey in Scotland itself and the famous grouse is, well, uh, this kind of moor chicken. Oh. <laughs> oh, looks like a chicken, yeah. Oh. And uh, the famous grouse uh, is hunted in Scotland. And uh, I think sometimes it's protected, uh, but uh, people are happy to hunt them. Um, yeah, and it's owned by Eddington, the Eddington Group. Uh, the brand and there are the Edinburgh group has three distilleries Highland Park, McKellen and Glen Turret and Glen Turret uh, has the name uh, home of the famous grouse and they have a, a huge famous grouse from, from bronze uh, in the entry to the distillery so this is the home of the famous grouse and this one is a blended grain whiskey the Eddington Group does not own a grain whiskey distillery. That means uh, cereals which are not malted are used for production, typically wheat. In former times it was maize, uh, but today it's wheat because the yield, the alcohol yield, is higher in wheat than in maize, uh, even when the wheat is more expensive. Uh, so they have bought the grain whiskies and it says blended grain so it's not from a single distillery but from several distilleries and which one I don't know Cameron Bridge, Campus, North British, Port Dundas um, well I think this one is uh, colored as well and uh, it might be young because it's such a cheap whiskey in the travel value okay and what it says here serve from the freezer oh. whenever you cool something you lose aromas there is a, a tale that if you increase temperature by 10 centigrades then the amount of aromas coming from the liquid or the whiskey doubles so if you come from the fridge uh, then you have a fourth of the aromas coming out of the whiskey. So what do they have to hide? Mitches. What do they have to hide? Some weird taste? I don't know. We will see. 40% ABV, a little bottle. Ah, you see, I have a new glass. Uh, this is handmade especially for me. I designed the shape of the glass and uh, I think there will be a video about this glass, I'm not quite sure. Um, it has the same volume as the old one uh, but it has a different shape in the uh, cupa, the tulip uh, and a, uh, a better 
upper end for letting the flow of the tongue uh, be more broad, more broader. And it's from crystal glass. It's a little spicy. Sweetness coming up. A little, very little vanilla. And it's, well, it's soft. There's no extreme aromas, it's soft. So this is not from the fridge. It's just room temperature, approximately 20 centigrade. Full and smooth. I was afraid that there might be a bitterness from this spiciness, but no, there's no bitterness. A little sweetness, licorice, yeah, licorice, oakiness, and nothing is burning, no alcohol at all. Smooth, mellow, warm and long aftertaste. So this does not really taste like a whiskey, I know, or I'm used to. So whenever you're a friend of a single malt whiskey and prefer the malt whiskey taste, then this is different. It's a grain, and especially it's a blended grain. Yeah. Thank you for watching. There's more to come, as always. I won't stop my tastings. And feel free to share your thoughts in our forum and uh, your tasting notes in our whiskey database. Thank you very much.